guys, this is Sarah from Sarah Jane Design and today we're going to learn how to make an ordinary mug like this into a wonderful little succulent garden. You'll need a dish like a cup or a mug, potting soil, water, your succulents, some mesh material, drill or a dremel tool with a diamond bit, gardening gloves if you prefer not to get your hands dirty, safety goggles, a mask, and some earplugs. Okay, so first what you're going to want to do is drill a hole in the bottom of your dish to ensure that the plants get the drainage that they need and that the roots don't rot. But before we do that, let's suit up in our safety gear, which is most important. Goggles, please. So I am wearing shatterproof lenses, however, I like to have that little added layer of protection. Earplugs. We'll need this too. Earplugs. Plugs. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so once you have the hole drilled, what you're going to want to do is add your mesh. Now I've cut a nice about one and a half by one and a half square already, and you'll just position it right over the opening. This way you won't lose any soil when you rinse the water through. So now we'll add our soil. This is a cactus mix you can pick up at any local home improvement store or garden center. So you want to fill it probably about halfway, but it really depends on the size of your succulents and how large the root ball is. Now if you're planting a cutting, you don't need to leave much room at all because obviously you don't have any roots, but just make sure if you do plant a cutting, never to plant it right after you cut it. You want to make sure that the end cauterizes so that the plant won't rot. Little trick my husband taught me. Okay, so we have our soil. Um, I'm going to take some of these. Uh, these are actually cuttings that I got from a friend. Makes this even less expensive. And really, you also want to make sure it's not sitting too high because if I've done this, made this mistake, if your plant's sitting too high, then when you go to water it, the soil will wash off the top, so we want to avoid that as well. And then let's do one of these. I love these little guys. They're so geometric. I find that mixing different succulents in one container with different colors and shapes and textures really adds a lot of interest. push in the plants from under the leaves with some firm pressure to make sure that it's well seeded. And then lastly what you're going to want to do is water the plant, really wash through the water, through the soil, out through the drainage hole, and that'll really kind of set everything. Plus you wipe off all this ugly dirt. <laughs> Normally I would be using a hose, but here I'm not really set up for that, so. So there you have it guys, a super fun and easy and simple and inexpensive way to make a fun little succulent garden, especially when they're in a mug like this. Thanks for watching and look for more videos from sarahjanedesign.com on the link below. Bye!
Monty, everyone knows I like to be square. <laughs>